Hi everyone, today I'm going to show you how to um, use the JavaScript API to uh, build an add-in for Office. So I have with me here an Excel worksheet. Um, it's just an empty workbook and if I go to the Office Store, press Insert, click on Store and um, look for this uh, add-in called API Tutorial. This add-in is going to help us understand how the API works. Press Add, and you can see here that um, if I close the Office Store, I've already done this before I started recording the video. There's this, what we call a content pane, um, that I can drag around within Excel, and there's a few things I can do with it. So the first thing I can do is to uh, create a range of data and what this means is that a range is simply you know just a collection of cells that are contiguous to each other um, so it can be a row it can be a column or it can be you know like a 5 by 15 kind of deal so I'm just gonna select create a range of data and this little uh, code snippet here and you can always resize this to see more of it um, this little code snippet here shows me how I can create some data and fill it into my spreadsheet. So if you look at this uh, function here, it's it's really just kind of taking in a context and this context is passed to you from the uh, Excel app. So this is really just a reference to the uh, application itself and we're getting the workbook off this application. We're getting the active worksheet off this workbook and we're saying to th that, um, that sheet, you know, um, give me um, the uh, range A1, so give me the, the cell A1 and fill it in with this data, quarterly sales report, and um, make sure the font is century, and make sure the size is 26, and also, um, I have a bunch of data here, and fill it in in cells A2 to E8, and and this, this whole bunch of code here is really just saying, let's just go do it, and let's tell the user if something goes wrong. Let's try it out and see what happens. So press run code, and um, there you have it. You have all the data filled in into the cells. So by just writing JavaScript code and by interacting with the, uh, the child objects of the um, context, you can easily interact with the application that contains this content added. Of course, you can also um, do things like reading code. So let me figure out what's going on here. Okay, let me go back to the content pane. And now I can just, you know, read the content from the Excel worksheet. And I want to say, get me range A1 to E8 and clear it, which means delete all the data in that range. So that that just happened. Uh, all this data that was, you know, in A1 to E8 has been removed and we see a success message here. So what I've just demonstrated is, is really an add-in, this little content pane here, an add-in that you can create um, that uses the JavaScript API to interact with the Office app that contains it. If we have any questions, just post it below in the comments and please subscribe to this channel. Check out my other videos as well. Thank you.